Congratulations, by the way. They were garden squash like balloon animals and snapdragons. Oh, and upstairs, I saw a real mouse circus. Not pretend like the crazy man's in our house. You sure you won't come? Don't fret, Charlie. They'll love the new catalog. At least they'll love my chapters. I did not call him crazy, Coraline. He's drunk. Well, I guess I'll see you around, you dizzy <gasps> dreamer. Dad, I'm not five anymore. gonna wear boring gray clothes. No one will have these. Put them back. My other mother would get them. Maybe she should buy all your clothes. So what do you think's in the other apartment? I don't know. Not a family of Jones imposters. Then why'd you lock the door? Oh, I found some rat crap and I thought you'd feel Safer. They're jumping mice, Mom. And the dreams aren't dangerous. They're the most fun I've had since we've moved here. Your school might be fun. With those stupid uniforms? Right. Had to give it a try. How do you feel about a mustard ketchup salsa wrap for lunch? Are you kidding me? Hmm. Had to go food shopping anyway. Dad's planning something special. Disgusting. You want to come along? You can pick out something you like. Oh, like the gloves. <sighs> Look, Coraline, if things go well today, I promise I'll make it up. That's what you always say. Won't be long. But I might be. Dearest Coraline, Miss Spink and Miss Forcible have invited you downstairs after lunch. I hope you like the new outfit I made you. Love, Mother. Hmm. Wibey's got a cat like you at home. Not the quiet Wibey, the one that talks too much. You must be the other cat. No. I'm not the other anything. I'm me. Um, I can see you don't have button eyes, but if you're the same cat, 
How can you talk? I just can. Cats don't talk at home. No? Nope. Well, you're clearly the expert on these things. After all, I'm just a big fat wusspus. Come back, please. I I'm sorry I called you that. I really am. How'd you get here? I've been coming here for a while. It's a game we play. She hates cats and tries to keep me up. But she can't, of course. I come and go as I please. The other mother hates cats? Not like any mother I've ever known. What do you mean? She's amazing. You probably think this world is a dream come true. But you're wrong. The other YB told me so. That's nonsense. He can't talk. Perhaps not to you. We cats, however, have far superior senses than humans and can see and smell and... Shh. I hear something. <laughs>